Hey everybody, how's it going? So I got a quick update on the light for my wife's um, garden stuff. So please stick around, check out the video, and I'll see you guys there. Thank you for watching. how's it going all right so just a quick final update on the fluorescent light fixture so all the wires that I wired in got this grommet set in there uh, or these two grommets set in there so it will hold this extension cord wire and I took some half inch wire loom and I just loomed up um, the best I could um, so that way there wasn't wires everywhere um, try to see if I can get this a little flatter So it's not so all up in the way uh, so now I'm gonna put the cover back on just figured I'd show you guys real quick make sure this is all fit so even since I put that switch in here it looks like the switch is in the way so I'm gonna have to cut that out a little bit. Oh, switch isn't high enough. Dang. So it looks like I'm gonna have to modify this. Section right here. It's like I gotta modify this notch right here. Let's notch this out a little bit. All right, so get a marker. And I totally didn't think about that. Probably should have put the switch on the outside. right there Okay, 
So I just quickly notched that out and just bent the tab back. See, so the switch is usable. It's plugged in, you can turn it on, turn it off. I'm gonna put the other ballast, or the, not the other ballast, but the other um, lights in. These lights, you have to slide them down, you gotta twist them. Slide down, slide down, twist till it clicks. And then what I'll do is, uh, I'll do a separate video after it's all hung and everything. Switch it on with all four. All four turn on. So I ended up using the uh, Milwaukee M12 three inch cutoff tool. It's got right here. Just to make that quick notch. I'm sure if you would have put it out here at the edge, it probably wouldn't have had to do the notch, but it'd be okay. Switch off. So that's just a quick update. And then I'll uh, grab the lid. So here's the lid. like with the lid on it. One of the bulbs isn't working. Now. It's interesting. Why is this? No, oh, oh, it fell out. Really? Nice and tight. Okay. I have to watch out for that. There. There's all four of them. Housing's a little finicky. So, that's that. And then I need to add the chains, but I'm not gonna show you guys adding the chains. Um, I did. Just flip the light a little bit. 
I did put a little number eight machine screws through the back. And I'm just gonna add another nut and the chain and a washer. Turn the light on so you guys can see it. These guys right here. And then uh, just put the chains on it, hang it, and be done. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell notification icon for future updates. Go check out my Amazon affiliate links, my Acme Tools affiliate links, my DJI Electronics affiliate links, as well as my Ohio Power Tools affiliate links. And uh, top of the description, I also have an Ulsa Tools link that will get you 10% off your order at ulsatools.com. As well as it kicks me back 10% off my next order, so if you do use it, it does help me out. It helps me bring tools to the channel and stuff like that. Appreciate you guys watching. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Peace!